Welcome to Home Food Best Food. Click on the red subscribe button to subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon to stay updated with the latest recipes. Today's video is about removing the tarnish from the silver. Take a big pan and add around 1 liter of water. Switch on the stove. Next to this add some aluminium foil. Just rip it apart and put these aluminium foil in this pan. I have added around 6 to 7 pieces of these aluminium foil. Next add 1 tablespoon of baking soda. After this add all your silver puja items. Using a fork or spoon, move all the puja items. See to that all silver items are in contact with aluminum foil. Add more water if required. It's been just one or two minutes that the silver items are in water and you can already see the magic. Yes, the part that was dipped in water and contact with alum aluminum foil has got rid of the tarnish and the part that was above in the air is still with the tarnish. This part of the glass is still with the tarnish. And the other part which was dipped in water has already lost the tarnish and or is already polished. When the silver reacts with atmospheric moisture and gases, it forms a thin layer of corrosion that's called as tarnish. It's been 3 to 4 minutes that the water has been boiling. If you want, cover the vessel and boil if you don't like the pungent odor. After 5 minutes, switch off the flame and remove the silver items using tongs carefully, one by one. Use a scrub to remove any residual tarnish. Do you remember how black this ball was? Now it's shining clean. Let's learn the science behind this reaction. Tarnish is actually the result of chemical reaction between silver and sulfur containing substance in the air. Silver is actually combining with sulfur and forms silver sulfide. The reaction between silver sulfide and aluminum takes place when the two are in contact while they are immersed in the baking soda solution. As with almost all chemical reaction, the reaction is faster when the solution is warm. The solution carries the sulfur from silver to aluminum. The aluminum sulfide may adhere to the aluminum foil. It may be floating around in the water having detached from the foil or it may be a pale yellow flakes in the bottom of the pan. To be more precise, aluminum displaces the sulphide from the silver and silver is free of the tarnish. 
I hope you have enjoyed learning the science behind the cleaning of silver using aluminum foil that we have been seeing since long. The best way to store these silver items after cleaning is in the Ziploc container. I hope you like this video. Subscribe to my channel and thanks for watching.